Join me on my first solo trip to Bodega Bay, where I'm on the hunt for the very tasty Dungeness crab. My goal today is to hit that limit of 10. And if you like the video, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and that notification bell, so you don't miss any future videos. Alright, enjoy! Toby. What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Chingy and today we're, at, we're here at Bodega Bay. It's about 6 o'clock in the morning and so right now I've got my two rods out. Right there. We're doing some crab snare in the day. Got 12 ounce on that one. And then I got a 10 ounce on this one. So I've already casted and I pulled up two females so I had to throw them back. The bait ready, and as soon as the sun comes up, I'm gonna see if I can throw this actual crab net. See if I can get anything in there. I don't know, I've never done it before from shore, but uh, I guess we'll give it a shot and see what happens. Yeah, that's a steep. 
Chicken in here, squid, and some anchovies. I'll make this little walk down here and see if I can see how far I can go out with my waders on to drop off this net out here. out here. Crabbing parkour. It's like crab fit. Alright, I'm gonna just leave that out until maybe the tide goes down. The tide goes down at 7:30. We'll see. I'll check it again in about an hour. First keeper I've got, I guarantee this is a keeper. Anytime you come out here, you better have a gauge. It's more than six and a quarter. Wow, that's a good size. And it's a nail. Perfect. Perfect. First, first keeper. No, no. Let's go. six and a quarter all right let's try to pull up this trap
this guy right here. So I'm gonna keep this one. Everybody else gotta go. Everybody else gotta go. Oh, no, that's a few. Dang it. They're all females. They're all females. Took all the bait and the crab slayer. Good morning. coming in so far I've got five dungies and one gauge busting rock crab Oh, a 
bunch of small ones, all females. Let's see. All females. So with reeling it in, you want to take up all the slack, as much slack as possible, until your line is completely tight. And then you're going to do a big swing, like this. Oh yeah. Crab on. Small one. Small one. I can feel it. Super small. Oh god. Oh, just kidding, nothing. Almost got my bait though. Make sure your snares are all open. Otherwise they won't work obviously. Stuff this bait back in there. Almost got me for it. down, snares are all open, and let's toss it back out. I think so. Six inches. Shoot, I think I got you, buddy. Well, this... Yeah. I don't know, I think... This is a female, I'm going to toss this one back anyways. Uh, female rock. No, no, man. It's all good, it might be me. Yeah, it might be me too, so. Let me see. I'll take this off. No, no, you're good, buddy. Did you get it? Oh, okay. Yeah, oh, yeah, this one's a big one, but she's a girl. She's out of the door, her back. Let's 
It's all rock crabs now. Is that the first female rock crab you caught today? Oh no, I've been catching them. Huh. I've been catching a bunch of them. Yeah, it's all rock right now. Yeah? Nice. Yeah. I might as well hang out. I think I, need, I think I might need like four left. I think so. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, I might have got yours because I can see yours moving. It's all good. Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. My last one was a rock crab, though. This one feels heavy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh nice, yeah, we were just... Oh, yeah, Alright, so I finished up the day with eight Dungeness, two rock crabs, two big rock crabs. And I wasn't expecting to stay this late, but it's about two o'clock and I'm ready to go home. It was a long day. I was hoping to limit out, but I was but I didn't get my last two. It started to rain and I don't know if that affected anything. But all in all, I had a great time today. New spot, super easy to get to. All you have to do is park on the side and you know set your rod and reel up cast really there was a steep grade so you have to be careful if you ever do decide to come out there uh, other than that it was amazing i hear that it gets really busy on the weekends i met a few really cool people out there super friendly I appreciate all, all those guys that you know gave me some tips and pointers for crabbing out here and they put me on this really cool spot to go and eat it's called Fisherman's Cove Seafood Barbecue and Oysters. It was really good. So I highly suggest that if you're out here half the day, if you want to get something in your in your belly nice and warm, they got some really good clam chowder out here. And I got some calamari and chips, and that was really good as well. All right, well, thanks for watching. Uh, until the next time, I'll see you on the last cast.